Just come on the road and watch what we're doing. You can't fake that. So my name's Nick and uh, today we're doing a quote for, for a gentleman who wants to have a home theatre in his garage. Hopefully by, by doing the quote and getting the job done for him he can, he can sit back and he can relax without having to pay the, the huge amount of money he'd have to pay to go to the cinema. This is an old lady, she found this in a local newspaper. I went out there just the other day to have a look at her stereo that wasn't working. We ended up upselling her a new stereo and record player. When we get there, the, the job's fairly straightforward. I've just got to remove the old stereo and, and install the new one, uh, and then show the customer how to use it. This job should take about half an hour to 45 minutes, and should make about 400 bucks. So we just went in there and installed the new stereo and the record player for my customer. I showed her how to use it all, and set up some wireless headphones on her TV for her. She's uh, really happy. She hasn't listened to music for the last 10 years and she can now. She loves it. I think I'll get a lot of repeat business out of her. She knows a lot of people and if you keep one person happy, you'll keep a lot of other people happy. The customer called me up a couple of days ago experiencing issues with his TV. So we organised the time to come out today and have a look for him. We got up on the roof and had a bit of a look at the antenna. The, the signal was a little bit low coming from the antenna, so I took the antenna off the roof and walked around and tried to find a better spot for the signal. Ended up finding out that the antenna was faulty um, after I tested my new antenna. Uh, the signals were, were much higher, so we ended up selling him a new antenna and also found out the, the booster was faulty. So we put a new booster on, went inside, tested it all and it was all good to go. Just got back from a job over there at Redcliffe and I thought I might just stop over here at the water, have a bit of lunch and just have a bit of a relax after the job. So the job I was just at, we, we sold a, an antenna and booster to the customer to, to sort out their issues. Obviously with that replacing those items, the, the signals wouldn't have been repaired. And if I hadn't have upsold those items, I also would have lost out on money as well. So with that job, I, I charged around $450. The profit on that one was about $350 roughly, and it only took me about half an hour, 45 minutes to get the job done. You know, if, if I hadn't have had the initiative to upsell and, and do the best job I could, I wouldn't have got that money. Um, it's been a pretty casual day, has it, has it been rushing around and no stressing, had lunch by the water, and it was uh, quite good, made, uh, made plenty of money today and I haven't really worked for it. So now we're, now we're finished lunch, um, I'm going to head off to, the, to my next job in Zilmir. This uh, lady contacted me on Monday, I went by and fixed up her signal for her. Uh, she called me back the other day um, to put in a new TV point for her. So we're going back and we're going to get that done for her. Uh, this job took maximum 20 minutes. We took the TV off the wall, replaced some, replaced some cable up the wall and under the house, put the TV back on the wall and I charged 130 bucks. Take out all the costs, it's probably about $120 profit for that 20 minutes work. The next job that we're going to is over in Fernie Grove. This guy called me yesterday uh, to come and have a look at his TV signals. He had a really, really old antenna, so we got up there and we got, got that replaced for him. Also replaced the cable from the antenna down the wall and into the lounge room. Tuned all the TVs in and job done, nice and easy. So this one took roughly 45 minutes to complete. We charged $418 for this one and we will walk away with about $380 profit. It's about four o'clock this afternoon. We had a pretty cruisy day, five jobs. One of them was a quote, and we've done quite well. Over, over $2,000 in sales today, so that's really good. About to go home. When I, when I get home, I'll uh, make sure I've got all my jobs booked in for tomorrow and I know where I'm going. I'll restock the van. I'll make phone calls to all my customers just to make sure that we're all good to go for tomorrow. Ready for, for the next day of work.